Hello, this is Kim Huat, Singapore number one eggs and vegetable fan. But Lao I heard la, that the Malaysian government will cut export of eggs la, to meet the domestic demand and keep prices down for their own people. Why Malaysia? Why? Why suddenly like that? Huh? Your chickens on holiday leave, ah. your chickens on strike, ah. your chickens the carton very pain ah, from laying too many eggs. Ah. So coincidence, huh? one moment there's a territorial spat over water, then there's a territorial spat over airspace, and suddenly ah, Malaysia not enough eggs to export to Singapore. Tan tan tan, ji tan. Don't worry, Singapore will always find a way to meet our own demand. For example, when the Malaysian leaders cow pay cow about water, ah, we decided we can drink our own urine. So, uh, egg self-sufficiency should be no problem. Anyway, we have many tan in Singapore. Uh. Tony tan, uh, tan ji se, uh, tan kin lian. Uh. Okay, uh, that tan to one. Uh. And also, uh, we have tan chuan jin. This tan is the best speaker of the house. Um -ch -um -ch -um -ch -um -ch -um -ch he also got many tan here. Maybe uh, the government can issue us uh, one egg, one person. Uh. Then we go and sit on the egg until hatch one chicken out. Uh. Then we use that national service chicken uh, to lay national service eggs for all of us. It's a great plan. Actually, uh, Kimwa didn't know uh, Singaporeans eat so many eggs. Uh. For example, uh, without egg, uh, all your prata will be kosong. And without egg, uh, mee rebus how to eat. And without egg, uh, wow, chai tao kui and cha kui tiao how like that. Eggs is life. That's why Singapore must work towards self-sufficiency and diversify our food sources. Don't let some chou ji tan hold us ransom like that. Yeah, they want to squeeze our egg. Ah. Tan ku ku ah, tell them. Huh? What? This just in. Malaysia government say they're going to ban the export of four species of fish and shrimp from January to February next year. Walaue. Wait, let me read this report for you. The Malaysia Agriculture Minister, Salahuddin Ayub, said, to prevent local shortages during the monsoon and festive season, mackerel, ravioli, Indian mackerel and pomfret fish, as well as shrimp, will be banned from export. What the fish? Whoa. First you play egg, huh? then you play fish and even play shrimp. Never mind, Singapore will prevail. We will grow our own fish. We are the biggest ornamental fish exporter, right? Go and find out whether guppy and the goldfish can eat or not. And uh, koi, uh, koi can make into fish and curry, right? Go and research, leh. We also better start buying our fish from other sources. Lah, huh? There are many fish in the sea. Actually, I want to thank all the Malaysia fishermen for working so hard, providing us with your fish. Uh. My mother loves your fish, you know. Every time I go market and buy one. But what to do? Your Malaysian government trying to affect your livelihood like that. We feel very sorry for you. Uh. Actually, uh, since I'm on the topic, uh, thank you to all the Malaysians working in Singapore. We love you very much. You work so hard, you're friendly. Actually, I also want to thank all the Malaysians in Malaysia also. We are very kawan kawan with you. We love you very much. Except your garment. Uh, sometimes your garment makes us very tulan. So, uh, what is the Malaysian government going to do next? First eggs, then fish. Maybe, I know, toilet paper. I tell you, uh, it's a plot. Uh. First, uh, they will tekan us how we eat. Uh. Next, uh, they will tekan us how we clean our backsides. Uh. Never mind. Singapore will find a way one. If you take on our toilet paper, we will use water to clean our pantas. Yeah, we will use new water. Uh, oh, waterception, uh, new water. Kim Wa always say, food security is important. And Pang Sai Chua security also. La. Count on me, Singapore. Lay more eggs, Singapore. Eat other species of fish and more. Don't be bully anymore. Don't be bully anymore. And maybe don't go Johor. Okay, la, still go. La. Don't be like that. La. We must still be kawan-kawan friend, right?